Welcome to the Wonder League's Robotics Competition. We are so excited to be here with you announcing this year's top teams and winners. My name is Amanda. And my name is Tim, and we are the lucky team members getting to speak uh, with you on behalf of all our colleagues here at Wonder Workshop. Um, this year's competition was definitely another year filled with all sorts of surprises. Some teams were able to complete the missions in person, and others had to remain working collaboratively virtually. Thanks to the virtual dash robot this year, it did make things a little bit easier to prototype code uh, before moving on to the physical robots. I agree, Tim. We were excited about changing some things up this year in terms of the format of the competition and the capabilities that Class Connect provides the students. We know that there were many teams starting this year using Dash for the first time, and the ability to use Class Connect and use the Blockly puzzles made learning those skills a little easier. Most importantly, you stuck with it. You gave it your all, and you showed us that you have what it takes to see something through until the end. Yeah, so take a moment, you guys, to high five your teammates for completing all the missions and reflect on what you did. Uh, yeah, high five right there. Um, <laughs> all of the, the amazing memories that you created and all, all the things you're going to take home from this experience, we, we, we know it's a lot, but take a moment to soak it all in. Uh, and, and now take a moment to high five your coaches uh, and your parents uh, for all the support they offered uh, through the journey as well. Um, and on behalf of Amanda, myself and everybody at Wonder Workshop, we'd like to thank the Wonder League coaches. Uh, honestly, we know how much time and effort this takes. Uh, many of us coach teams ourselves. So a big thank you to all of you. Uh, thanks for believing in your teams and letting us ride along on this journey with y'all. Yeah, we had so many teams that provided some creative solutions to their engineering challenge, uh, engineering challenges. Judging is always the hardest and the most rewarding part of our jobs here at Wonder Workshop. <laughs> yeah, as judges, we, we, we kind of have to get super picky uh, when it comes to these submissions because uh, so many of the students come up with very similar solutions to the problem. Um, honestly, it's the ones that think outside the box. Uh, and figure out what might not be the most popular solution, uh, this is probably the easiest way to make your team stand out. Um, for example, our most engineered solution in this year's competition was the lasso. Uh, he basically launched it out at the inventors and then Dash would spin around and pull the inventors back uh, into the portal. Um, while this worked, uh, technically, we were looking for something unique and well-engineered and, well, we definitely found that. It was after some long days though, right, Tim? <laughs> yeah, long days, long <laughs> yeah, nights. Yeah. nights that we were able to finally determine the top teams across the Innovator Cup and the Pioneer Cup. We cannot tell you how impressed we were with all the contestants work. Before we get to the good stuff, let's take a peek at what you have accomplished with this quick video recap.
pretty amazing, right, Tim? Unreal what some of these teams can do, Amanda. Absolutely unreal. All right, we are going to start with the Innovator Cup, uh, which is our six to eight year old bracket. Um, and in no particular order, we're going to announce the top three teams, uh, and then we will announce the Innovator Cup winner. Uh, so the top three teams, again, in no particular order, uh, is Team Owl Robots, uh, which is an all-girls team from here in the United States. Uh, the second team is an all-boys team, making it to the top uh, teams, again, for a second time, again from the U.S., the Enderman Ninjas. And our third top team was a boys and girls team from the U.S., the Robotic Panthers. All right, I need a drum roll now, man. Give me something. There you go. And the winner for this year's Wonder League Innovator Cup 2022. This is a really close one. Believe me, we went through a lot of videos to get this one. The champions this year is Team Owl Robots. Congratulations to this all-girls team from the U.S. with their coach, Heather Seeger. This team went above and beyond for this year's final mission. They carefully crafted their contraption and made sure it would follow along through a presentation in their logbooks. They even earned some extra points with some beautiful set design and design elements. It was a great example of design thinking uh, in action. These creative young ladies came up with an effective and creative attachment that utilized not only a lasso, but a pole system to grab each inventor individually and bring them back through the portal one at a time. Precise aiming, creative coding were absolutely needed. Uh, the team shared with us a fun and engaging story as they made it, uh, made sure they didn't leave anything out or let anything go to waste for their community tools. This team definitely stood out to all of our judges. So big congratulations to Team Owl Robots. Awesome inventing. Congratulations. Next up, the Pioneer Cup, which is our 9 to 12 age bracket. Again, in no particular order, we will name the top teams and then this year's Pioneer Cup winner. An all boys team from the U.S., the Panda Coders, a team of boys and girls from the US, the Contenders, and a team of four, two boys and two girls, Chameleon Crew representing the US. And it, it, we have to take time to, you know, point out it's, it's rare when we see boys and girls mixed teams working together uh, and the, these guys pulled it off, right, Amanda? Yeah, it sure is, Tim, <laughs> yeah. Okay, here we go. And the winner for this year's Wonder League Pioneer Cup 9 to 12 age bracket is Tim, drum roll. Come on. <laughs> Chameleon Crew. Yay. This boy and girl team with coach Andrea Smith had some very close competition this year, but their engineered solution really stood out from the rest. They were able to use Dash's drivetrain or wheels on a treadmill-like contraption to control a magnetic mechanism that moved up and down a ramp, picking up each, in each inventor individually along the way. What an awesome way to use Dash's wheels. This team's new broad news broadcast journey shared their story like we were right there with them. They had a well-designed coding solution, but it was their engineering skills that really put them ahead of the rest. Everything was really well done. I would keep my eye on this team in the future. They, along with so many other teams, have a very bright future in the STEAM world. Now, we have some of you who may be waiting on the last cup announcement, the Wonder Cup. I know I am, uh, but this year's Wonder Cup was a completely redesigned challenge. Using some parts from our partners at Adafruit to complete a line-following robot attachment. And you have to actually build something to put on the robots. Uh, teams were provided sensors that needed to be built on a dash or a Q robot, and then they had to program these uh, sensors to successfully follow a line. And the trick was they had to do it as quickly as possible, like the, the fastest time was going to win this one. Uh, but unfortunately, the anticipation is going to have to wait a little bit longer because our engineering team at Wonder Workshop will be presenting that winner tonight at 7 o'clock Eastern time. So be sure to register for the STEAM Summit site at spring.internationalsteamsummit.com to check that out. So you have to register, you'd have to tune in seven o'clock Eastern uh, to find out who the champions are gonna be. Well, Tim, year seven is coming to a close. What a year. Again, thanks for all your hard work and participation in this year's Wonder League. Stay tuned for more updates on what the future of the Wonder League robotics competition holds. And thank you for everyone for, for joining us and congratulations to the winners and to everybody. We hope to see you again next year. Thank you and congratulations.